What if I told you that reversing pre-diabetes doesn't have to mean giving up all the foods that you love? It actually starts with adding the right ones in. Now here's the surprising truth. Some everyday foods don't just avoid blood sugar spikes. They actually teach your body to handle sugar better. So in this video, I'm sharing seven simple foods backed by signs that improve insulin sensitivity and help you step away from the diabetes danger zone. It's Dr. Derek here. Let's dive straight into it. If I had to choose one carb for someone with pre-diabetes, this would be it. But skip the sugary packets. Go for steel-cut or rolled oats. You see, they're packed with beta-glucan, a type of soluble fiber that forms a gel in your gut. That gel slows your digestion and helps sugar trickle into your blood more gently. You see, a big 2016 review found that oats can actually lower fasting blood sugar and HbA1c in people with type 2 diabetes. So if you're in the pre-diabetic zone, oats might help you avoid crossing that line. Top it with berries and a pinch of cinnamon. You'll see why in a bit. Now, oats are a strong start, but protein and fiber-rich legumes take things even further. Lentils and chickpeas are true blood sugar champions. They're full of fiber and plant-based protein. You see, that combo, it slows down carbs and it keeps you full longer, which helps cut cravings and avoids blood sugar swings. A 2018 study showed that swapping just half a serving of rice or potatoes for lentils drop blood sugar after meals by up to 35%, plus they're cheap, they're filling and incredibly versatile. Toss them in soups, wraps, curries, you name it. And if you're worried that fruit is off limits, let me reassure you, berries are different. They're low in sugar, low glycemic and full of powerful antioxidants, especially anthocyanins, which help your cells respond better to insulin. You see, one study found that eating blueberries every day improved insulin function even without any weight loss. So when you're craving something sweet, go for a handful of berries instead of a biscuit. So pair an antioxidant rich fruit with nutrient packed greens, now that's a powerful combination. You see, spinach, kale, rocket, these leafy greens are absolute blood sugar allies. They're ultra low in carbs, they're high in magnesium and rich in polyphenols that reduce inflammation and support insulin function. You see, a huge study in the BMJ found that people who ate more leafy greens had about a 14% um, lower risk of developing type 2 diabetes. So don't just treat them as a side, blend them into smoothies, power them on your plate. They work hard for your blood sugar. But it's not just veggies doing the work. What you choose for snacks and breakfast matters too. Plain Greek yogurt is a sneaky superstar. It's rich in protein and it contains probiotics, those healthy bacteria that support your gut and help your body regulate blood sugar more efficiently. A 2014 study showed that daily yogurt eaters had a 28% lower risk of developing type 2 diabetes. The trick, make sure that it's plain. You see, flavored yogurts, they often had heaps of added sugar. So sweeten it naturally with berries or cinnamon. And when you need a grab and go snack that works for your blood sugar, not against it, grab a handful of almonds or walnuts. You see, they're loaded with healthy fats, fiber, and magnesium. These are all shown to improve blood sugar control and reduce insulin resistance. In one study, just two ounces of almonds a day help people with prediabetes improve their blood sugar and insulin response. They're also really satisfying, so you're less likely to grab a sugary snack later, but they are calorie dense, so stick to a small handful. Now, to finish strong, this last one might surprise you, and yes, even a spice makes the list. Cinnamon helps lower blood sugar by boosting insulin sensitivity and slowing down carb breakdown in the gut. A 2013 review showed that cinnamon significantly reduced fasting blood sugar and even improved cholesterol levels in people with type 2 diabetes. So try half a teaspoon daily, stir it into your oats, your yogurt, or even coffee. Small habits 
big potential payoff. So there you have it, seven simple natural foods that can help reverse pre-diabetes. And here's the best part, you don't need to give everything up. You just need to start adding the right foods that support your body instead of working against it. So if you found this video helpful, please leave a like and subscribe for more no-nonsense tips on taking control of your health. You've got this. And as always, I truly care about your health and I wish you the very best.